Uh, are you all right? Thank goodness. Um, I'm sorry. Looks like I was... You see? Sister? Thank goodness I made it in time. When I heard the accursed roar, I quickly went around and gathered everyone I But I never expected the first dragon hunt in ten years to end just like that. I heard the story from Isha. Without your bravery, she might no longer be with us. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. We call that horrible beast the Wandering Calamity. They've appeared since ancient times and have been most destructive. They last showed up ten years ago. There were three of them back then. We were fortunate to vanquish all of them, but we paid a heavy price. Young man of Eresia? No. Adol Kristen. Honestly, you've amazed me, sir. You see, steel weapons are useless against the Wandering Calamity. They can be used to weaken it, but you can't hope to slay the beast. You need a special weapon to penetrate its hard shell. This is forged from a stone called Emel, found throughout these islands. It's harder and stronger than any metal the Eurasians ever brought here. Olha's arrowheads are also made of Emil, which is why she was able to finish the beast off. But that's only because you had weakened it beforehand. To think you overpowered that monster without an Emil-based weapon. Sir Adol, you are a fine warrior. Adol, I need to have a word with you. Join me in my room. Uncle, you don't still think Sir Adol is... I just need to speak with him as the chief. You needn't worry. Well, come with me. I wonder what he could do, but I don't think you should worry. You did risk your life for Isha, so it cannot be anything bad. So you've come. We have much to discuss, but first, I'm, I'm so grateful that you rescued Isha. She and Olha are the precious children of my younger brother. Ten years ago, they sacrificed their lives protecting the village from the wanderer to think the same fate almost befell Isha. I truly cannot thank you enough. And I would like to apologize for my rude behavior toward you. You're only the second Eresian I ever... Most are greedy, have no love for the spirits, and try to disturb the peace in this land. Uh, uh, sorry. I'll get to why I brought you here. You remember the stone wall to the north of the Fountain of Prayer? Where the monster came out of, I mean. There's actually an underground passageway beyond that wall. It's an ancient path to the shrine. Apparently, it even passes below the sea and reaches Canaan Island. So... Now, I have a question for you. Would you be willing to use that path to cross to Kanan Island? That's what I thought you'd say. I hear your sword shattered in the battle against the Wandering Calamity. So in that case, take... This is a sword made of emil that borrows power from the spirit. You will acquire various skills and magic by upgrading this weapon. A great warrior like you should have no problem realizing its potential. Well, not to ask a favor in return, but can you do one more thing for me? If you cross successfully to Kanan, I want you to investigate the disappearance of the mirror. It's a sacred white mirror known as the Mirror of Zem which has been passed down to our priestesses for generations. It was stolen from our altar a month ago, the same day the pre- I don't mean to implicate the Eresians. 
but we've already searched all of Quatera Island, so it's highly likely that it's indeed on Kanan Island. I'm sorry for asking. Just make a note of it. on their way to Zenith Island where um, they say there's a similar path on Kanak but you just battled that monster. Why not? I see. I guess you're determined then. Well, at least allow me to give you a... Sir Adol, may Mother Alma's blessings Oh. The wandering calamity before the chief might not that. What is it? Uh, um, if Adol needs anything mended, he can bring it here. I was surprised. Granny's never said anything nice about it. you say well I guess there are some decent men e well I guess I have to re huh he off for crying out loud that my big sister's even more annoying than my mother I just Lady Wanuka came to help us out at No we wanna hurry up and get to cook too. are actually talking to me now. That was a bit of a shock. I've heard you saved one of the village kin. The bridge is still down, so I'll just try settling down here and continue with my... Huh? There's a path underground that can... Ah, I've seen underground ruins near the town. So that... I've heard it's crawling with monsters, though. It would be impossible for me to use that...
taking a look. I guess you want to see that pickered sty of a town. Well, you'll see that it can't compare to our island. Comparing Aresian culture to Redden culture is a sick joke. How can you small ears be so dense? The chief says that the underground path ahead should leap, but there are just so many monsters in there right now. I thought you'd be able to use it instead of the bridge. Looks like I don't have the right key. Damn, nothing I can do. Gotta look for another way in. What the hell? I didn't think I'd run across anyone else in this godforsaken place. Who the hell are you anyway? You don't look... So you're Adol Christ. <laughs> Never thought I'd run into you down here. Add all the red. I've heard stories about you. You're a damn little do-gooder, always meddling in other people's business. Oh, I've waited for this day. Let's see how a sharp halberd looks on a whiny do-gooder's face. Come on, show me your blue MLS sword is more than a shiny trinket. Still damn soft, but you've got some skill with the blade. I'm Geis. I'm an adventurer, but unlike you, I'm not too proud to be a mercenary. Keep going through here, and you'll reach Kanaan Island. There's a town just outside the ruins. You'll meet others from Europa who've washed up in this damn place. I don't want to hear that you've stuck your nose where it doesn't belong. Mind your own business, and you'll see this halberd again. <laughs> 